You're looking at the Roman Colosseum, an icon. But how did the Romans build this massive amphitheater in just eight years? It all started around 70 AD under Emperor Vespasian. The site was the drained lake of the hated Emperor Nero's palace, a huge public relations win. First, engineers laid a massive, deep foundation of Roman concrete in the marshy ground for stability. Next, the build. The outer walls and main supports were huge blocks of brilliant white travertine limestone hauled from quarries 20 miles away. The genius? Roman arches and vaults. These allowed them to build a freestanding four-story structure using concrete and volcanic tuff for the interior. It was strong, yet relatively lightweight. They even dressed up the exterior with columns in the Doric, Ionic, and Corinthian styles on each level. Construction was funded by spoils from the Jewish War and built largely by tens of thousands of slaves and skilled workers. It was an immense, non-stop operation. They used standardized, interchangeable parts for the seating, which helped them build fast. Emperor Titus finished it in 80 AD, adding the spectacular hypogeum, the complex network of underground tunnels.